guys. We're back. We just did the distilled wild sour key lime pie ghost. Now we're going to do this uh, angry Scotsman fallback. Let's got get this shit going. You know, I had never heard of this until I seen it at the liquor store today. Uh, 5.2%, 15 IBUs. It says creamy rich pumpkin. Oh boy. I mean, we're into these pumpkin, all this pumpkin shit, so I figured we should probably try it. And honestly, Casey's the one that noticed it on the shelf. Not yeah, me. Bradley wasn't down. He was just kind of like, eh, I'm going to suck Josh's dick. <laughs> <laughs> Sort of oh, I'm sorry. I didn't make it perfect. It's gotta be perfect. Man. I didn't make it perfect. Yeah. It's not good enough for Steven. This is the production over here. I Look. Feel like yeah. I had to contribute. We got the, fo the phone on the charger. The, really the, the microphone on a battery pack. With a wired, with a wired microphone, wired powered microphone, and then we got monitor. a monitor. Monitor yeah, that's that's a Chromecast to an iPhone. With production lighting. production lighting and overhead lighting and a heater. Heater. What do they got? A flashlight and a jacket. We've got two fucking Harbor Freight lights, a four dollar tripod. They're fucking Sam's Club lights. So suck my nuts. <laughs> and we've got fucking sweaters and beanies. I've got a fucking FR shirt and no fucking beanie. A pair of long socks and fucking slides on. God and damn I got it. two and three quarter inches. Fuck Shit! You I couldn't say that. Too, so too much. That's too much. Too far. <laughs> anyway. anyway. Anyway, pumpkin. Go get it. The fucking can caught my eye, and I was like, "Hey, Bradley, you tried that yet?" He's like, "No, I haven't." So here we fucking are. Well, that's a great story. Great story. <laughs> great the story. Was bad. You want to hear the best part of the story? I was just thinking I would like that guy to suck my dick because he's got a furry beard. I mean, Tickle the balls a little. Yeah. The best part of the story, though, this is the first review beer Casey's ever bought. Oh, yeah? Well, we'll have to no, cheers to that one. I bought the last one, you fuck. <laughs> what? Okay. I this one. Okay, this is the first time Casey's ever bought review beers. <laughs> it is. That's true. Casey buys drinking beer. So how many times That's have you gotten drunk off of me and Brad and Todd? Uh, a lot. <laughs> Like, hey, you want to do reviews with us? You might need like, to pitch in. That's fine. I, I mean, kind of, I have been kind of feeling bad about it. Dakota he's never has. It, he's mentioned it a time or two. Maybe you can tell. Talk about, I, talk I mean, you can. Him. You can truly really tell Dakota was a Bernie supporter. Yeah, he is. He is. <laughs> I don't smell any pumpkin. It just smells like nice and like roasty and kind yeah. of malty. All right, cheers. Yeah. Uh -huh. False advertisement. Yeah, I have no idea. Yeah, I don't taste pumpkin at all. Honestly, if I just read that it was a Dunkelweizen and pumpkin wasn't on the can, it'd be a lot better. Yeah. But I'm not getting a pumpkin. I don't either. At all. Although that kind of makes me happy. I'm not big on pumpkin. It needs more cinnamon and stuff in it. More spices. Yeah, yeah maybe. Maybe some nutmeg. I don't know. Maybe like a uh, maybe a real mellow kind of taste. Like that's what Ross was going for. Or whoever done the, this one. All I know is Ross needs to at least grow the, the beard out, like the dude on his label. Seth <laughs> uh oh. Something just shat the bed. Hmm. It just said connecting to Jesse's video. <clears throat> or now you guys look like Minecraft characters. <laughs> you are too. <laughs> I don't know what to do. Are he, we like real laggy? No, I see you. He's sucking dick just like normal speed. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> we'll just keep going and me and Casey will look kind of funny on the TV screen. The buff out. And Casey looks normal anyway. I'm too goddamn <laughs> sexy for this screen anyway. I'm too sexy for this hood. <laughs> Get naked then. All right. <laughs> 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 Ooh, beanie hair. I have extra layers on, so it'll take now, me a little while. Be careful with the belly button. That's dangerous. Yeah. <laughs> I did, hey, the, I, we told Steven earlier we went back and watched all of his YouTube videos that one night. That's why we went back. 
to look for the. We were, button yeah, shit. we were talking about the fucking belly button shit, and we ended up down a fucking rabbit hole of Steven's YouTube channel. <laughs> like we found. The we one. went back to where you were like shirtless with no tape over your belly button. And did you see? The, did you see the one when he had bottle like caps? Bottle, the bottle caps, gorilla tape to his nipples, and his brother just ripped one off. <laughs> No, I don't guess we found that one. That sucks. Okay, yeah. what's funny about that one is, at work there's a guy that was getting into drinking different be beers, so he started looking them up on YouTube. He ran across me on YouTube, <laughs> a guy at work, and guess which video he ran across? The one where I was drunk off my ass with bottle caps on my nipples. <laughs> so he's at work going, Jesse, are you on YouTube? I'm like, oh shit. I was like, what'd you see? Did you have bottle caps on your nipples? Damn. Yeah, that was me. So the whole shop ended up knowing that motherfucker was drunk on YouTube and bottle caps on his nipples. When I first started my job, there was a guy that he kept telling me, man, you look really fucking familiar. You look familiar. I can't figure it out, but you look familiar. And then like a week later, he comes up to me. He's like, holy shit, dude, I seen you on YouTube. And I'm like, oh, motherfucker. That's so weird. Don't do that to me. I get drunk and talk to my fucking cell phone. Leave me alone. Hey, if somebody <laughs> sees me in person, they're like, hey, that guy's been on YouTube before. They're probably going to be like, that guy's really fucking gay. He likes to suck dick. <laughs> They'll be like, hey, babe, like, that's the guy that likes to suck dick. <laughs> you got 10 yeah, bucks? Because that's all he's charging. We've never done a video without me saying that I want to suck dick or something. Hey, babe, can I have $5? <laughs> this dude offers blowjobs. I mean, you got four kids. It definitely kind of shows you don't like to suck dick. Ooh, four kids? You got five kids, right? Four kids, five kids? Four. Yeah, eight between all the kids. I can bring kids. all four of them out here right now. Yeah, should we bring all eight of our kids out here right now? Hey, what we could do is one of those, uh, uh, you know, <laughs> Iraq face. Veteran 88, 88 well, videos. One, right? I got one. Yeah, I got one. I got one. <laughs> You're a lucky motherfucker. And I'm about to make a doctor's appointment. I'm about to make a doctor's appointment to get my we're stuff snipped. Good. Yeah, we're going to hold I'm hands. I'm done. We're going to hold hands. You are a goddamn smart man. I guarantee fucking you. Hey, you guys, you guys could do one of those IV 88, 88 videos. You know, when he lines up like eight watermelons and sees how many watermelons a 30 out six could take out. You guys could do that with the kids. <laughs> hey, me and Steven are going to make appointments. Well, eight kids stop a 50 cal. <laughs> <laughs> and then yeah, at the end of the video, you go, go got to get back to fucking... <laughs> <laughs> how many how many kids can a claymore kill? <laughs> <laughs> we got video. Ready? Go! Boom! One, now, never mind. None of them made it. <laughs> Me and Steven are about to make appointments, and we're going to go sit in the chairs and hold hands while we both get snipped. You're about to make a porno? <laughs> we're going to get snipped. <laughs> <laughs> we're going to get fixed That's together. Fun. Are you going to look at each other's dick and balls? No, they'll have a little. Uh, they'll we'll have, have a little, little curtain. Yeah. We'll hold hands. Yeah. Is, it, is that really guys like still gay though? Because you don't have pants on. <laughs> well, there's a doctor in the room. There's a doctor in the room. It's definitely not gay there. Is it a man or a lady? <laughs> Bye, dude. Yeah. You got to shave your own balls so that's though. Three guys and two of them don't have pants on and are holding hands. Yeah, with another guy touching the genitals. Sounds good. <laughs> It sounds real good. Anyway, Ross, back to your beer. <laughs> uh, well, yeah. Five hours bad. later. <laughs> well, I'm not a fan of it. Sorry, I'm not. For what it says. I mean, for a dunkle wise it's really good, but I don't get any pumpkin. It's or not vanilla. creamy or rich either. No spices. Uh, vanilla, no. Right? Yeah, the spices are really low. Ugh. <sighs> For some reason, I thought I'd seen vanilla on this can. No. Fruit ester just, complexity. Cooler weather calls for comfort beers. Our twist on pumpkin beer adds the roasted gourds to this German-style dark wheat ale to create a rich, chewy beer packed full of fla fall flavors. Classic Weizen yeast adds a clove and fruit ester complexity. I don't know why I thought I read vanilla somewhere. That's weird. That's fucking... That's what happens when you do meth, kids. Don't do it. 
Yeah, it's fucking mine. Robot yeah, I'm using robot dick. Hey, how does C-3PO's <laughs> cock taste? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> huh? How does C how does CP3O's dick taste? Is it oh is that no this? Does it go beep boop beep when you shove it in your throat? It's peppermint. Kind of. <laughs> 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 it's real fucking dick. I mean Alright, I'm looking over here, so y'all better start fucking rating. Okay. Right, <laughs> and remember, rate up high, not hey, don't look at us, oh. rate up high. Rate thank up thank you, thank you. Uh, I'm going to go by based off what it says on the can and I'm getting alright Casey we're going based on what it says on the can Brad alright Brad I'm going to give it 8 based on what it fucking says if it didn't say pumpkin it was just a dunkle wise and I'd give it better than that alright so uh, 3 out of 4 people in this world are mentally retarded and we just found the 4th one yep we gave it a 6, 6.5, and this motherfucker gives it an 8 for what it says on the bottle. I mean, other than the pumpkin, it's a fucking creamy, rich dungleweizen. There's no pumpkin. Yeah, but read the goddamn label. It's supposed to have the fucking pumpkin. <laughs> it's it's a fucking gourd. There's no goddamn pumpkin. What the fuck ever. All right, anyway, we'll be seeing you. I don't like fucking dungleweizens, okay? What's next? He likes some beef dunked in his asshole. <laughs> What's next? Yeah.